And beaver depend on large stem willow, large, large aspen for food. They eat it, but like most importantly, they use it to make dams. And the dams like raise the water table, cause water to spill over on the landscape. And that essentially creates more willow habitat. So um, you could think of beavers as kind of willow farmers, you know, so they're like eating it, but they're making more of it. Uh, and willow have these pr have pretty interesting ecology where their seeds are only viable for like a really short period of time. So like, like a matter of days. And if that seed that comes out of a willow doesn't land on bare soil, it just dies. And so you need that dynamic water table lower raising and lowering that beavers create to to make more willow um and like thinking going back to the elk the elk they can eat willow down to the ground and keep willow really small and those willows just aren't big enough to to make dams for for beavers so you don't really think of beavers and elk in competition but uh you know every single time there's a whole bunch of elk there they will eat the willow to the ground and the beavers lose out wow yeah. They're farmers and engineers. Yeah, they're farmers, engineers. exactly. Yeah, <laughs> farmers and engineers. Yeah. Do you think beavers are one of the wildlife species in the park that maybe aren't thought about enough for being able to craft and build such a you know, beautiful environment? Totally, yeah. The, the, the attention is always goes to the big ungulates and bears and mountain lions, but beavers have a bigger impact than all of them when they have healthy populations. Yeah. Is the population here healthy? No, it's not. Yeah. So it, it has been in decline for a long time. And it's a little bit complex and, and not fully understood why. But we know that, you know, around the time when the park was created, there were like over a thousand, maybe even 1800 beavers in the park. But now there's almost certainly fewer than 50 beavers, maybe even like fewer than 20 beavers in the park. 